Hi everyone, it's Natalia today. I will talk about oversharing. More and more people sharing their personal lives on social media. It can be fun, but there is a line between sharing and oversharing that we should not cross. Let's see how it could affect our lives. People can learn too much and use it in evil ways. For example, they can hack into your account or steal your identity. Please don't risk it. Sharing too much information with your co-workers, friends, family or partners is not a good idea. This can make it uncomfortable for them and might hurt your relationship. Before you share something personal, consider whether it okay to say. Sharing too much can lead to nasty comments. Not everyone online has good intentions when they comment on someone's life. People can be mean and make fun of you if you share too much. Uh, so be careful about what you share as people may think wrong about you. Don't share too much online. People might think you are unprofessional if they see picture of yourself partying or doing bad things. This can hurt your future when employers look at your social media accounts. Sometimes when we have a bad day, talking to someone about it is okay. But if we talk too much with people who are mean or say bad things, our feelings can get worse. This can make us do things that hurt ourselves and our mental health. What to do if you cannot stop oversharing? If you found yourself oversharing, here are some tips to help you stop. Before posting something online, think twice about it and consider whether it is appropriate to share. Consider the audience. Are you sharing with people who will respect your privacy? If someone is not respecting your boundaries, take a step back and don't let them pressure you into sharing too much. Don't post when you are emotional or angry. Wait until you have calmed down. Take a break from social media if it is hard to control your oversharing. Spend time with friends who will help you make healthy decisions about what to share and how much. Thank you for watching. It was Natalia.